Hi, I'm Lynn Bruning, and I produce the eTextile Showcase, which is a fashion show of wearable computing and e-technology. And I also coordinate the eTextile Lounge, which is a place for about 15 to 18 designers this year, both from research, from university, from artistic performance pieces, of which they can all come in one area to, to form more of a community, to help each other out with their own projects, and allow the Maker Faire audience to come to one location to learn about e-textiles and wearable computing. The craft and technology fusion allows people to experiment with multiple disciplines. It also allows scientists to come into the field, it allows students to come in, it allows um, small children to become involved at a very easy level and approachable level to electronics, technology, and coding. It makes it more friendly. But it also allows us to explore issues of adaptive technology. And with that, we're allowed to help people that may be underserved, such as the blind, such as some other form of handicap, maybe autistic children, and help them have a better experience and integrate into society. Most people just do blink and bling. So it's like putting rhinestones on clothing that are animated. We can also begin to activate them with temperature sensors, sound sensors, motion sensors, and create environments, clothing, textiles, of which give you information in yet another manner. How approachable it is, that it's really actually very easy. Um, some people, I get engineers coming in that don't know how to sew, and I literally have to sit down with them and help them thread a needle. It helps me when I go to solder, and I remember the first time, and I'm like, flux? What's flux? <laughs> so it's, we're sharing information and developing a common language.